Hey guys, what's going on? It's Doconic here, and since there's been no news updates on a Sunday night, which is really unlike the Oakland battle, we're just going to go ahead and do a little bit of gameplay today. So, I'm grinding out the medals for the Super Go tanks. Not a priority, I'm still working on my medals for the, uh, the physical Gohan from the uh, Bojack event. I want to try and get those medals so that way I can get a whole bunch of Gohan, Super Saiyan Gohans at SSR. Uh, you know, the Z Awaken version at SSR. So that way, if I do pull the LR Gohan, I could feed that into him to get him up to Super Attack 10 before I Doken Awaken him to LR when he becomes available. Hopefully, that plays out. Wow, I got real crap for key, huh? Um, anyway, so I have been, you know, doing this on and off just to use up my stamina so that way I have stamina reduction. It's like 12 30 at night. I'm ready to go to bed. I just figured, you know, let's go ahead and do a quick video going after this event to eat up my stamina before I pass out. So first things first, all right, cool. I'm running an LR Broly team. I have my Gogeta 100% maxed out, by the way. He's 100% dupe system. Um, I have, let's go ahead and click over here. I have my Vegeta for defensive purposes. I have Super Saiyan God Goku, the Goku card, because he is a really good linking buddy. The Super Saiyan 3 Goku from GT, because I've been prepping him for the Super Saiyan 4 Goku when he comes out. He has some dupe system fed into him. Things that like Super Attack 4 right now, 3 or 4, with all four dupe paths unlocked, and I have a lot of crits up. Um, actually, let's go take a look. I forgot. What do I, what do I have? Over here? Yeah, he has 11 crit and 3 super attack and 13 super attack. Oh, sorry, thir 3 double attack and 13 super attack. So, And he's at super attack level 2, so I lied. <laughs> um, I also have LR, my LR Broly, which has uh, all the free paths done. And then I have this friend LR Broly, who's just freaking nuts. Uh, critical of 14, and I mean, I don't understand how he got to this. He's nuts. Um, but yeah, and I got the Piccolo just because he does more damage when he gets the Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks. Blah. Anyway. Uh, there's that. So yeah, I'm grinding these out. I'm trying to get my Gotenks, my, my trunks, on my, the Intelligence Trunkses. Um, I got them uh, awakened to level 80. And I want to Doken Awaken them to get a Gotenks because I want that physical Gotenks to get up to Super Attack 10. I think I currently have him at Super Attack 6 right now, because I think i got a full 5 on there. So I think he's at Super Attack 6, and I want to get 4 more. And then for the hell of it, I'm thinking about just doing it to the Strength 1. I might not Z-Awaken these guys to Ultra Rare once I get them Doken Awaken, but just enough medals. I'm really going to grind it out, honestly, once I get to uh, the Super Saiyan 4s, if, they're, if they have what they had available on the GP side, which was half stamina, Doken exclusive events. So if that's a thing, then I'll be I'll be doing it there. It'll be a lot easier to grind out. Plus, like I said before, I want to focus on the Gohan. So if I end up getting the L the LR Gohan, I'll have something to, to run. Yes, perfect. Oh man. So yeah, outside of that, man, I'm I'm kind of happy there hasn't been any updates. I mean, I know that there's a lot of a lot of hype generated whenever there's an update or anything like that. But let me tell you, providing content uh, based off of updates that come out it's man it's it's taxing man you know you, you're about to go out you're about to go do something and next thing you know you you, ha you see an update come out and you're like oh man i gotta go record a video i gotta go get out some news i mean wrong i love doing it for you guys but man it could be it could be a pain sometimes uh, but outside of that I, I've, I've been thinking about changing the channel name you know keeping doconic obviously and it, it, if you notice my url i have the custom url forward slash doconic but I've been thinking about changing the, the actual name. I think I'm going to do a, a small video uh, asking your opinion, putting a poll up for a couple different names I've been going back and forth with. Uh, I'm small enough where I can still do that, and I have enough of you guys actually subscribed and following me on a regular basis where I figure, you know, I can get a good idea of what you guys would, you know, I can get actual some input on what you guys think. Uh, we're going to keep the Godku with Broly just because then... Let's do that... Wait, yeah. No, no, we could do this. Then we're gonna get the strength orbs. I've been playing around with a couple names. I might release that video either at some point later today, if I think of one by the time I wake up in the morning, because after this video I'm going to pass out. Yeah, look at that, 100%. Oh yeah, let's hope he gets the triple attack with all crits. That would be so insane. Uh, there's that. And you know what we're also gonna do? We're gonna use the Bulma, just to speed things up a little bit. because I do more analytical videos on the channel, you know, it's just my name, Doconic, yeah, but people might, you know, well, someone might look at the channel and be like, I don't know who the hell this guy is, but if I do something a little bit more specific to what I do, you know, you guys know, you guys have been here for a while, 
I've, I do a lot of analytical videos and card reviews and event reviews. I don't do a lot of gameplay videos like this, but that's because I like going over the events and giving more analytical approach and also helping you guys with tactics just instead of brute forcing your way through events. Not everyone can brute force like, like this event. I'm brute forcing my way through this event, um, but not everyone has the means to do that. So I figured, let me, let me at least try to let people know what they're getting into when they come over and stop by on my channel. All right, what are we going to do here? It's my Broly, so we're not gonna do too much. We just wanna get super attack off through the double. And oh, that's only three, one, my Gogeta, because my Gogeta's 100% maxed out. We should be good on, yeah, because that Vegeta's gonna take a whole bunch of damage. Oh yeah, that's right, Boss Rush releases, well, let's see, the, this will be me releasing tomorrow, Monday morning. Um, so Boss Rush releases tonight. Well, tonight if you're on the West Coast, uh, tomorrow morning, early morning if you're on the East Coast like I am, like 2.30 in the morning. I won't be playing it as soon as it comes out, but I'll be releasing um, a video later on tonight, well, as soon as the event comes out, going over which cards you can run if you're lacking the top tier units. So stay tuned for that, so if you are new and you're just watching the video for the hell of it, go ahead and hit that sub button. I'll, I'll be doing a, I do a lot of analytical videos here. Uh, okay, cool, here we go. You can... Ooh, how am I gonna play this? Hmm. Yeah, I guess Piccolo's not gonna get what he what I want him to get. Uh, I guess we're gonna have to do this. It doesn't matter. He's gonna go down after this round anyway. Dude, this I remember when I used to play this event. This was the biggest pain in the ass event that I would that I ever had to play. And now the cards just make it so much easier since I got all the badass cards. I wish that Piccolo like had the thing where you only if you got up to Super Attack 9 he or when you get him Super Attack 10, he would launch a, a super at you know Super Attack 9. Or Keenan of Key of 9. Oh man, Ooh, look at that. Yep, he's dead. He's done. Now real quick, I'll go ahead and show you guys something of what I was talking about before about getting those trunks of super attack up. If you haven't seen the video, I did the video on how to raise super attack. I know in that video I didn't go over every single damage multiplier around, just the basic ones from huge damage up until uh, colossal, mega colossal. So uh, there's different types of immense and different types of different types of uh, damages. I should really do a follow up on that just so that way everyone knows what I'm talking about. But yeah, let's go ahead and I'll show you exactly what I'm talking about. Because now I can Z awaken or Doken awaken this trunks and that's what we're doing and this is what we're doing so yeah so now we have him now he Doken awakens into 420,000 Zenny Doken awakens into that go tanks now I'm not gonna go ahead and actually feed him in at this point just because I'm still I need to Z awaken him first I want that guaranteed if I'm gonna go through that grind I want to make sure that I get him. yeah I have super attack 5 actually ba 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 and you are at SSR. Yep, 50%. So once I once I get him Z awakened to ultra rare, which I know it's a, I think it's a uh, supreme kind metal. But once I get him uh, awakened, it's a whole bunch of Zenny. Then he'll have that 100% chance in order to get him up. I want him to protect him before I Doken awaken him because I don't think his Doken, his Doken awakening isn't available yet. But it's going to be available in the future, and I really really want to get him Doken because once he's at super tech, then he is a beast that kid. Now let's go take a look at the potential system. I forgot. I don't think I have any potential system in on him at this point in time. So yeah, the super. There we go. Come on, bro. And there he is. Oh, what? Do I have one? I don't. I don't have one. I just have a little bit of, of him in the bottom right and the top left. Now the major, I should get him to the double double attacks, but uh, that's the plan. So once I get him to Super Attack 10, and I'll probably get the bottom right path unlocked for him so he can start doing more damage. He's very viable on a hero's team because he seals, especially if you're going against the boss rush event. He's really good because he seals there. And he's also really good on a mono physical super team. Or just a mono physical team in general, but mono physical super team because, you know, it's Gotenks, and the mono physical leader is Gotenks Super Saiyan 3. But anyway, guys, that's it. That's all I want to bring to you guys today. A little bit of a uh, gameplay video because I don't do a lot of gameplay on the channel. Um, go on and hit that sub button if you're new here, and I'll go around some ideas about what I want to rename the channel to. Thanks. Catch you guys later, and have a good one.